Hi, potato. Welcome in. You beat everybody else today, holy. <laughs> I think the clock in Redemption is so... It's pointless, but it's funny. You know, this is this is Chatter's summer jobs now. And no, you will not be paid overtime. Hi, Bobo. I mean, I guess technically I'm the one who's clocking in late, right? It's almost noon. Oopsie. Weekend stream? I know, ain't no way. Hi, Bliplup. Can we get some yo's? Rare chatter. Dude, I should stream just on the weekend so Pliplup can watch. <laughs> nah. Dream every day? Dude, that would... I would literally... No, I should not say. <laughs> um, it would be very detrimental for my physical and mental health. Like, imagine going live every day. I mean, I think it only makes sense if, like, every day you stream, you get, like, guaranteed money. Like, if you're, like, a one candy, you're gonna be able to, like, make hella bank just off of ads. But if you're a no, or if you're a humegalo like me, it's kind of like, it hurts your channel when you stream too much. Tuesday is your last day of school? Let's go! Let's go! Guys, I only have two weeks left of college. The reason why- oh, I'll talk about it when I turn face cam on. Uh, a streamy day keeps the doctor away. <laughs> yeah, surely. I mean, should I do that instead of eating apples? I don't eat apples every day, so... Guess I gotta stream, add that to my daily routine. Controversial, but I'm not too big a fan of apples. I don't like the texture as much. They look juicier than they are, so it's kind of like disappointing biting into an apple sometimes. Guys, new tweet, new tweet, go like it. Some apples are better than others, yes. I agree, sometimes you do get a bad apple. A rotten apple. One minute, everybody. Get ready to spam. Uh, I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> Ay, Dios mio. Guys, a million subs and I'll turn face cam on right now. What is the sacrifice redemption? Oh, that is for Cult of the Lamb. So we play Cult of the Lamb during subscriber-only streams. So maybe if you get lucky, flip up and get a gifted, or if you sub with Prime, you can watch those bonus streams. And if you miss them, all of my past sub-only streams are on my YouTube VOD channel. So exclamation VODs in chat. If you're gonna watch old ones. Okay, everybody. Three, two, one. Holy moly. Whoa, why is it showing that? Hello. Good morning. Good afternoon. Hope everyone is doing well today. Oh, well, it's technically noon for me, so it's... Unless you're in Hawaii, I guess it's still morning. Um, we're doing calligraphy and portrait cards today. Sneak peek, sneak peek. I posted on my Twitter, but... <gasps> Holy moly! Wow, that's what we're doing today. Um, I haven't been live for three days. Last time I was live was Wednesday. Because if you guys watch the stream on Wednesday, if you watch the VOD, I got an email during the stream of being like, Hey, you're not gonna get your fucking diploma, you silly billy! So, what happened was, 
I was being a silly billy, and I didn't request enough FASBA federal aid to cover my last few classes, so... So, this is a big so. Um, I owe my school $7,000? RIP. But, it's okay, because I can either take out a FASBA for this school year, and just apply late, or... I can just pay out the seven grand myself, and there's no late fee, there's no time limit for me to pay it back. So I can still, whenever I graduate at the end of the month, I can still request my transcript and like get them printed off. I just won't get the little fancy dancy diploma that I can frame, which is great. Cause in some states, I live in Washington state, um, but the laws follow whichever uh, state your college is in. But for example, in California, there's legislation protecting students, so, um, universities, private universities and public cannot withhold your diploma if you have all the credits. But luckily, my school doesn't have that law. Let's go. So, I'm on track. I was losing my mind all fucking week for those two days, because, um, on Thursday and Friday, I had to wait for callbacks from my school and DSHs. So, that's why I couldn't stream, because, like, I literally had to have my phone on standby and, like, pick up the phone right away if I got a call. So, that was Thursday and Friday. I was stressed on my goddamn mind. Um, but that's all figured out. I'm still gonna graduate. It's not like they're gonna, um, I was gonna say deport, but that's not the right word. It's not like they'll, like, not, they'll, it's not like they were gonna kick me out of classes. So, that's great. Um, did you get crumble this week? No. Um, the only cookie that looked good in that, in, I guess, last week's lineup was the vanilla one. But it's probably going to taste like ass. Because, like, their, like, base, um, vanilla cookie base is kind of bad, in my opinion. But hopefully, I'm, I'm praying. I'm praying that this week's lineup will have more fruit in it. I don't like lemon, so I didn't try the lemon one. But if they give me a strawberry, holy. Um, okay. And then for DSHs, um, I am, like, so mad. I'm legit so mad. Because I've been uh, waiting for two months now for my application, and it's an issue of, like, staffing and, like, them not having the information from my doctors because my doctors are, like, not speed earning. They they've requested my, like, medical documents, like, a month ago, almost. It'll be a month and two days. Um, but they haven't submitted it, so I had to print off my own fucking documents and, like, all my test results and, like, hand them off to my local DSHS office. So I, ha I had to do that on Friday because my cutoff date was Saturday and the close Saturday. So that's why I couldn't stream Friday. <laughs> oh my god, it was so fucking stressful. Because, like, you know, we hate capitalism. I'm a socialist, okay? But it's like, I just wish it were easier to, like, get benefits. It's so fucking hard. Once you're in the system, it's a lot easier. But if you're initially applying, it is hell. It is hell. So hopefully, PC to pray, I get approved. If not, I am gonna be very sad. I will click go live and cry on stream and farm subs. That's what I gotta do. Anyway, I just wanted to rant. <laughs> so that's why I couldn't stream Thursday and Friday. And then, what did I do yesterday? Oh, yesterday I was editing! Because I was like, I don't think I can stream today. I was like, I can't do it. I was still like, coming off the... I guess the peak of stress from Thursday and Friday. So I edited. Guys, can I, I can't really reach my keyboard but my youtube clips channel gotta go bye potato we'll see you later on everybody go subscribe to my youtube's clips channel so youtube.com slash at peace in 17 clips i am uploading my daily shorts along with an edited clip like a regular 1080p 720p clip every other day and so i posted it on twitter as well explaining it a bit more but I know some of y'all get sad when you don't see your clips in the best of compilations, but don't worry. You might see it in a regular whole ass video. Because since my clips channel has got a thousand subs, I need to get watch time up, so shorts did not count towards watch time. So we're gonna be uploading more clips. You guys are getting YouTube exclusive videos now. You're not gonna see those clips on TikTok or Twitter or IG Reels. You're only gonna see them on YouTube, so go sub to the clips channel. And watch all those videos in your subscription feeds. I always check your Twitch chat to see if you're gonna go live that day. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, I was planning on going live today, but I was debating if I was like, should I do my homework first or stream first? And I was like, I'm gonna be good and do my homework first. So now, 
I can take all day if I want to. I'm not gonna stream all day, honestly. I'm very tired. Um, but I was like, I'm gonna do my homework first. That way I can not rush when I stream. So we'll have a bit more time to do art today. Um, but yeah, I usually update my pin message. <laughs> I mean, it's mainly for people like you, Kobobo, who like do go to offline chat just to double check. Because like, I know whenever I go live, I only tweet like a minute before I click go live. So it's kind of like, if you check the chat like 30 minutes before, then you'll know if I'll go live that day. That's the main reason why I do it. Okay, enough rambling. Let's get to the meat of today's show. Today, the plan is simple. Oh my god, face reveal. Hand reveal, everybody. It's real. I've decided for summertime, I'm gonna grow up my nails. I'm not gonna paint them. Um, you can't see it on camera, but like, this part down is like all damaged nail, but this part up is all nice natural nail. So I'm gonna grow out the icky part of my nails and then I'll start painting again in fall. Anyway, that's why I got bare fingers. I was gonna paint them for Pride Month, but I don't, cause like whenever I do darker shades, it like damages my nails more and it stains them and it looks gross. So, <laughs> I'm a fake, I'm a fraud. Um, let's see, let's see. So, for the month of May, we did have two people eligible for a sketch card. We had Kolbobo and Kim. I also have two other sketch cards from previous months. We have one for Mac and then one for Titans. A big reason why I was late, I was planning on going live at 11. But I didn't because I lost, I lost, because I sketched these out a few days ago, but I lost them, so I had to redraw them. So I was like speed running this morning. I was like, oh shit, I gotta get four cards sketched out in 15 minutes. That's why I was a bit late. But you know, I'm here. Okay. Enough stalling. I've stalled long enough. I need to get another orange pen really quick because this one is busted. Okay, so this is the number 44. As usual, we're gonna start off with all of my new followers that I gained in the month of May. I think I gained like 30 followers, which is kind of crazy. Um, I mean, because the followers I gain is different in my analytics than what is my actual follower account, because, like, people unfollow or if I get, like, bot follows, then it doesn't count. But we got a really good handful this month. I am really excited to see where this channel goes during summer. I will have more time to stream, probably, because I'll be out of college. So look forward to more very fun streams this month, everybody. Um, oh, if you want a sketch card drawn of yourself next month, all you need to do is make sure you gift a total of five subs for the month of June. Right now, we have Kobobo with two, Mac with one, and then Kim with one. So you guys are on the board to get it, or on track, not on the board, not yet, to get a card this month. Okay, I'm gonna rearrange my space a little bit and then I'll get started. Oh my God, buy pride. I love the smell of the color pencils. They smell like more refined crayons. D the, uh, this does not mean go huffing crayons or colored pencils. That's not what I'm saying. They just smell really nice. <clears> hey, <throat> okay, time for work. June feels so much slower than May already. I kind of agree with that, honestly. But then, it doesn't feel like it's June 11th. It only feels like it's been a week, but it's been a week and a half. I'll get a prediction up in a second. Oh, my sister and I went out to eat last night. 
We went to Olive Garden. Overpriced as freak, but nothing will be Olive Garden's Alfredo. It's so good. I want to figure out how to make it. It's because the texture of the sauce is like immaculate. Everybody, prediction is up. Go gamble. Do you think I will mess up the calligraphy today? I have about 30 names to write. Do you think I will 100% PB no mess ups? Go gamble. <clears throat> I saw a TikTok exposing the recipe. Hmm. I'll have to find that. Something that was interesting is I had the Toscana soup, which is like kale soup, kale cream based soup. And instead of like cubing the potatoes, they had them in slices. And it was a really interesting texture. I'll have to try it next, or next time I make it. I'm gonna move my mic. I always forget which direction I talk, and I actually turn my body to the left. It's weird. Okay, this blue is kind of busted too. All of my pens are busted. <laughs> Is this month's Mario Kart tournament gonna be normal? Probably. If I do it, honestly. <laughs> Tee -hee. Man, the last tournament I did was my birthday, right? I mean, so it's only been like two months. It's not horrible. some yo's hi mac you've been holding off to buy online and see you do playing with viewers no you have you have to practice online you got a man yeah, everybody clock in if you haven't already make sure you're on time Okay, chatters, be honest. Who watched the new YouTube clip video I posted yesterday? Because it said I got like four views from external links. So that means from like Twitter or Twitch. Clips on uh, YouTube, clips channel, youtube.com slash at pcid 17 clips. I posted it on Twitter. I'm gonna be uploading edited less than one minute clips as regular landscape videos instead of shorts you did thank you Koboba. because 
That video did got like five views more than like a best of comp. Which I know is not a lot, but usually my regular upload videos don't perform- they perform very poorly when compared to my shorts. It just popped up in your sub feed? Great. That is good. Because anyway, I know like 15 views is like nothing. But I need to like keep track of it. Because like I know it's probably worth to like edit short form like normal clips. Like I still need to put more time into like fully edit it like 20 minute highlights. But I just don't have the time. Yeah, you can use hashtag shorts on a regular landscape video, but it does not show up in the shorts feed. They changed that UI, they fixed that glitch like years ago. <laughs> So you can't leech up the algos, unfortunately. Because when you upload a video on YouTube, you can choose if the video will show up in user subscription feeds. So I think by default, all of my regular landscape videos and vertical short videos show up in sub feeds. Which is fine. Oh, I forgot to cross the T. That is not a mistake. That is not a mistake. Don't worry. I fixed it. I always think it's interesting to see, like, um, follower count compared to engagement, like, either live viewership or a number of chatters. Because I usually have a CTA, which is a call to action, on most any post I make. So, like, on my TikTok, it'll say, follow for my big gaming clips. Or the first thing in, like, my, or the second thing in my YouTube clips descriptions is... I go live on Twitch on weekdays, go follow now, exclamation point. So like, I wonder how many of the followers I gain naturally are people being like, oh, I'll drop a follow, but never watch <laughs> or just never chat and I'll lurk. I think it's interesting. That was me. Let's go. It worked. I love when people listen when I tell them to do something. I just dropped a follow and never watched R.I.P. But now you watch every stream, smile. Oh, Mac, you want to see your card? I had to resketch it because I lost it. I did your hair and face more stylized. So we'll do that later. And Mac, this is the last card you have queued up, like backlogged. I'm just saying. <laughs> Honestly, I think it is um, a hate crime if you don't sub with Prime this month, everybody. Check if you have a Prime available. It is Pride Month. 
I feel like I remember you posting calligraphy on TikTok and that's why I followed. No way. It must have been wait, I did a I did a TikTok live stream where I did calligraphy once. No way you followed me because of that, man. That's crazy. No way. I probably would have like I know I did a live stream once or twice where I did calligraphy. And then I like posted pictures on my story, I think. I mean, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, it's been a while since you've been in the channel, Cool Bobo. Another page done. <laughs> At first I thought everyone just got written once, so that's why I screenshotted. I remember you telling me that. That was so cute. <laughs> You're like, I went back and screenshotted. <laughs> Sorry to answer a text. Oh my god, my friend. So you know how I told you guys they were gonna get me a weighted blanket for my birthday? Well, it finally came in the mail. Oh my god, it is game changing. It feels like... How do I say this? Okay, if you've ever had like a GF or a BF or a partner, you know how when you're like cuddling on bed and they're like laying on top of you? It feels like that. And it's nice because I'm an incel and not banging anybody, so it's comforting. Does it not make you sweat? No, mine is actually like really breathable somehow. It did take me, like, two nights to get used to it. Because, like, it is... I got the lightest one. I got a 15-pound one. But it's still, like, very noticeably. Like, you can feel the weight. But then I just imagine in my head it's a hot grill, and I'm like, oh my god. <laughs> um, it's Pride Month. It's Pride Month. <laughs> Read about feels like someone is on top of you. Well, I'm weird, okay? Yeah, so anyway, whenever I use the blanket, like, if I lay down in bed, I fall asleep within, like, no joke five minutes. It's crazy. It's magic. But I've still been waking up at five, which is a big bummer. I feel like someone being on you feels different than a weighted blanket. Okay, let me just... It's my imagination, okay? I like to... <laughs> Don't ruin my... <laughs> Don't ruin my fun. You know how you can ruin my fun, though, is by following the channel. Because, everybody, we are 30 minutes into stream. So, if we new here, follow. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. And if you follow today, today only, you get your name written in the journal. Wowie wow. <laughs> I don't know. I've had a GF. It's a softer feeling. Men sound solid. Did someone say men? Hi, Titans. <laughs> no, we were not talking about anything bad. It's Pride Month, Switch staff. It's Pride Month. Oh, Titans, I'll probably have time to do your card. <laughs> no! 
Not me. <laughs> I like Titans. I actually had to re-sketch it. Because I lost it. But I, I made it for you today, man. I've cuddled with a man not as comfy. Uh, you, you just gotta find a guy who has, like, different proportions. That's all I'll say. <laughs> it was also a friend, so it wasn't romantic. I don't think I could ever cuddle with a friend. You know, I... I catch feelings quick. You catch my drift? Because, like, all my... Most of my crushes in high school were, like, literally friends. for one minute. I look away for one minute. Jesus Christ. Look what you've done. Look what you've done. <laughs> First time Kobobo gets a deleted message. <laughs> okay, Meg. Stop, guys. Oh, no. Ay, Dios mío. <laughs> you know, I agree with what Max said. I'll say it. No, it's, it's not that it's like a bad word. It's just like... It's like, uh... It's just like certain words will like steer conversation in a direction that I don't want it to go. And it's not that I don't have those conversations in private, it's just like... <laughs> I don't know. Did anybody see what kind of gay am I filter on TikTok? I've seen people do it and it's funny. I'm surprised it was the first to say it. No, I think it was brought up before, I just didn't delete it. Anyway, let's talk about something else, guys. what do you, um, have for breakfast? Ooh, well, this name is everybody's fan favorite. You had a cookie for breakfast? That sounds pretty good. <laughs> Men? <laughs> Mods! Why is it plural, Titans? Explain. <laughs> oh no. I know I don't necessarily read every single chat message. I usually, like, read them all in my head. But it's funny to see, like, like you guys goof and gaff with each other. Oh yeah, Max from New York. I feel like some of the most underrated breakfast is when there's like a breakfast sandwich but it has a bagel as the bread. <laughs> it's 
<laughs> Wait, I like little Nas X. What does that make me? Uh oh. You prefer roll? Okay, if anybody says they like biscuits with their breakfast sandwich, they're a psycho. Slash J slash S R S. Mac, why? You know you can't say that word here. I think it makes you a piece in underscore 17. Valid. Valid. Max said a slur. <laughs> I'm kidding. I'm kidding. <laughs> guys, guys, guys. You know, it is Pride Month, but let's not push the limits. Does everybody need to be put in timeout? Does that need to happen? Listen, if you don't say stuff during Pride Month, I'd be offended. Valid. You know, I'll say it. I, I'd be very happy if I had a GF, you know? Wait, is there a month for veterans? I know we have Veterans Day. But do they have a whole month? They do have a military month? Oh, shit. Okay, that's not a mess up. I just fucked up the line. Ketchup is good with breakfast because it gives a little bit of acidity, so it kind of wakes you up a little bit. And I think, Cold Bobo, you saying brekkie sandwich is either the gayest thing you've ever said or the childish, or the childish -ist thing you've ever said. The childish-ish, most childish? Childish-ish-ish. Did I try the Strawberry McFlurry? I have yet to try it. Is it good? I haven't gone to McDonald's since the promo. It's a Strawberry Cheesecake McFlurry. It looks really good. Oh, you know why I haven't tried it? It's because I have my own, like, ice creams in the freezer. Because I bought, like, a one of those big-ass tubs of vanilla chocolate swirl ice creams, and then I made strawberry syrup, and then I bought a cheesecake and I diced it and then I made little ice cream cups. Cost 20 bucks. But still cheaper than buying like cuz it made made like 12 servings. So 12 times $5 for a blizzard, so a third of the cost. That is so much work. No, it's not. It's so easy. I mean, not gonna lie, like, dicing the cheesecake was kinda hard, because I bought it frozen, but in the time it took for me to, like, walk home from the store, it was, like, melted. Uh, 
I'm lazy. I don't have the time or space to do that. You know, I got the time. I don't have the space. You know, I told y'all my silly little roommates brought home 12 cartons of cherry vanilla ice cream. And my sister doesn't even like cherries, and my other roommate does not like sweets. So nobody's gonna eat the fucking ice cream. What happened was, one of my roommate's relatives were like, Hey, we went to Costco and we bought 12 cartons of ice cream, which you'd like some. And my roommates were like, sure. And they took home all 12. My parents buy so much junk food it makes me mad. Because then they get mad at me for not eating it. That's good. I was too, but they bought food that I didn't like. And my mom would bitch all the time about like us having to throw stuff away. Yeah, the ice cream was on sale. But still, why would you buy 12 cartons at once? Peace and swore? Am I not allowed to swear? This is my channel, guys. This is not a no cursing stream. I can say what I want to say. when I can afford to, I will do another no cursing stream. Because I miss being able to do streams where I could gift subs as takes. Like, that was fun. Because, you know, I love giving back. I'm a commie. No, the ice cream doesn't expire for a year, so it's solid. But then it's like... Those 12 cartons take up like a quarter of the whole freezer. So it's like, I can't buy what I want. Your piece in ends up gifting a million? Dude, I don't, I don't swear that much, okay? It's not that bad yet. I have some self-control. Your freezer must be huge. Um, it's just the... Because since we share rooms in the unit... We have the freezer that's like connected to the fridge and then there's also like an external freezer like a mini freezer in the garage so six of the cartons are in the freezer in the garage and six are inside but it's it's too much You can afford to swear more at 30k followers, don't worry. I mean, I'm not there yet, man. I'm, I'm like not even a... Not even 1% there. Yeah, but the freezer that's in the garage, we aren't supposed to use. So we had to ask if we could put the ice cream in it. Oh, that L is floating. Ignore it. Does somebody else use it? Yeah, the people who own the unit. It's it's their freezer because it's not included in the unit. So it's it's their freezer. It has like it has a bunch of seafood in it. Like when I opened it just to like organize it one day, like it it reeked. <laughs> but you know what? Not my shit. That ice cream is gonna taste bad. No, it won't taste bad. It's just it's gonna smell a little bit funny. That's why you keep it sealed until you eat it.
Also, the reason why I don't read out the names as I write them anymore is I'm so scared of, like, somebody, like, baiting me to say a bad word. Because usually whenever I get a new follow, like, during a stream, I Google the name just to see if it's, like, secretly a bad word in another language. Usually it's not. None of the new followers chatted. No, we had a few. I'll turn back. I know, I recognize a few names. Let's see. I know Clover's chatted there from YouTube. They comment on a few of my Mario Kart videos and say how bad I am. And then Doc Doc has chatted before. I think they said they're from IG Reels, which is insane. And then the Roomies. So we've had a few chatters. Usually in any given month, even if I get like however many followers, I usually get like two to five viewers who actually chat within their first month. Usually a lot of people lurk. And that's great. We love lurkers. It is kind of scary to chat. So don't ever feel obligated or that you need to participate, you know? Just listen. Listening is just as fun. Unless? <laughs> I was on my phone with my friend the other day and they were telling me that the unless bit is getting old. And I cried that night. Do they watch? No, no. It's just whenever I talk with them. Because, like, some of my bits I do on stream translate to my normal conversation. And, like, unless is the one I do all the time. Yeah, should I, um, cut off this friend? <laughs> At least they're honest. Yeah, this was the same friend. Remember I was telling you guys about the mints in the theater? This was the same friend. <laughs> so this was honestly, maybe they were trying to get back at me for being rude to them and giving them a mint when their breath fucking stank. I think fives are my favorite number to write. Dude, Chatters, if you can land me a job to be the guy who draws the Trader Joe signs, I will be forever in your debt. Cause that legit would be my dream job. You know, get to do calligraphy, design signs. I love that aesthetic. I want to practice it. Because we have a local produce stand that's like down the block. And their signs look like ass. I'll say it. But I'm trying to see if I can like, you know, be like, hey, I can draw your little signs. Go for it? Maybe. Because, like, the one day I was walking by and they were, like, riding the signs, 
it was like some teenager and he was drawing asparagus and it looked so bad because their signs are usually just like a big notepad and they just write with sharpie and it was so bad hi potato welcome back can we get some yo's Ah, oh, damn, this would almost fit. Damn. Damn, damn, damn. I'm always, like, marveled by all the people who do choose to follow and hang out. Because, like, I say this, I feel, every month, but it's so easy to get disillusioned by the total number. But since most of my followers aren't bots, and usually I just block the bots anyway after stream, it's wild to think that like I've made an impact on somebody to an extent. Cause this month I've gained like 30, which isn't a lot number wise in the big scheme, but that's still like 30 people. I think it's because when I was growing up, I didn't have many friends. And I didn't use social media until I was an adult. So I didn't, like, get the brain rot early on. But I've, I've, I feel like I have such a greater appreciation for, like, any like or comment I get. Oh, wait. I want to read this off. I'm going to put a chatter on blast. Yeah, I got to put do not disturb mode on. Remind me to turn it off, chatters. Oh, here it is. Let's see if I can show it. This is it. So, this is a singing clip that I posted a month ago. And Crystal replied to it the other day. They're like, I come back to this whenever I'm in a bad mood and it helps me feel better. Like you devoured this cover. Crying emoji. And I, op I woke up to that reply and I literally, like... I was like, damn... I was like, that's so cute. I don't know. It's just because, like, I know individual viewers have an impact on me. And also collectively as a group, you know, knowing that people will want to hang out and watch the stream. But to think that I have, like, a positive impact, even if on a handful of people... Makes everything seem worthwhile, you know? Shout out to Crystal. Now they're a wholesome chatter, I guess. Yeah, I, I think Facebook is kind of D-O-M. The only reason why I keep up with it is to see if there's any, like, new drama. Because, like, I've had a few friends from school have gotten, like, married. And one of them is no longer married, and I'm like, oh, Yes! Okay, this one has six ends. Okay, one, two, okay, two, four, six.
this name looks like a hashtag ad, but it's not. It's not. Don't worry. I did say the only sponsor I would take would be Subway or Nintendo. When I have my own product to show, everybody exclamation shop in chat! Exclamation shop in chat! I'm use code Twitch10 for $10 off your purchase of an original artwork painting today that I made. Not a robot. <laughs> Can Twitch sponsor you? I mean, there's been Twitch sponsored like streams, but they're usually only hosted on the front page. And I know that Twitch, with all their recent controversy, with their third party ad regulations. Um, I wonder what the landscape is going to look like in a month. Peace on front page for pride. Okay, chatters. Imagine we do the I write your followers name calligraphy for a front page dream. Imagine how many followers I would get. That. I don't know. Because when Cutie Lee was on the front page, she gained, like, less than 20 followers. But she was playing a game. Like, she was playing, um, Overcooked or some shit with Scootish. So, I wonder if you did this concept for a front page stream, how many followers you'd gain. Huh. Because a lot of the streams that are on the front page, people don't actively seek out or watch. It's kind of like, it just auto-plays. So that's what a lot of the view count is for those streams. It's just auto-play. So, it's not like you're gonna guarantee to like, pop off. How do you get on front page? Um, there's a team you can reach out to as a creator, and you can put in a request in if you have a, like, a big stream idea, or if you fall under a highlighted category. So like for Pride Month, if you identifies queer if you are POC during like API month or Black History Month you can request to be a highlight. Why is there no pride tag? No, I have an LGBTQIA tag. Why would I not? I mean I don't know if I'd ever want to be on front page. Because there's a lot of like pressure with it. And like I said, just because you get on front page doesn't mean you're going to grow from it. Because my approach to Twitch is I'd rather grow as naturally as I can. Like that's why I don't do collabs for the time being. What was I gonna say? I forgot what I was gonna say. Oh, it'd be different if Twitch was like feasible income for me. So like, let's say if I didn't get a certain viewer count, then I wouldn't get monetized. That's a whole different story. Then I'd probably be focusing on collapse more. But since it's not, I can do whatever I want and grow naturally. And I think when you grow too quickly, you kind of become disillusioned. Everybody, um, um, 
what what time is it? It is time for me to run some ads because we are an hour industry. So, if you want to avoid that ad, all you need to do is subscribe for four ninety nine, just five dollars. Skip your coughing and ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link your Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for people with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a Prime sub available. It is Pride Month. You better give me your fucking primes, everybody. Um, Prime for Pride. <laughs> also, we're gonna be doing sketch cards later today. So if you yourself want a portrait sketch card drawn on stream in July, make sure you give five subs this month. Okay, I'll see you some of you guys in a few. Oh shit! <laughs> That's a short key. It's a hot key. Oopsie. Oh, Megalo. <laughs> yeah, don't worry. It just showed the starting soon screen. Don't worry. That was a bit. That was intentional. change the music. Ooh, let's do We Fit. I liked it. Well, I like We Fit. And who's in charge? Me. <laughs> I should make my stream music playlist public. That way you guys can listen to it offline or something. I'll do that after stream. Okay, we're in the final. Final five, everybody. Or final four. Okay, this blue is done. Can we get some yo's? Hello. If you have any preferred nicknames or pronouns, make sure to tell me. Can we get some yo's, everybody? I was just going to say how chill the music is and how it gives Mario Galaxy vibes. Well, I will not be skipping back on the music track. I am sorry. <laughs> no special privileges here. <laughs> well, welcome in, man. <laughs> it was not Galaxy. I think the playlist- okay, I'll give you guys the title. I'll give you the title of what that comp was called. Um, it was called Relaxing Music from Yoshi Games. On YouTube. I mean, I will always have a bias towards, like, Wii generation music. That was Yoshi music? Yeah, it doesn't sound like it, does it? Okay, I need to throw this blue pen away. You can see how, like... It's, like, feathery.
Okay, another page done. So many... I didn't realize... Well, it's two, four, six. It's eight per page. Oh, that's why I have, like, four pages. Do you guys have a favorite Minecraft texture pack? No, I've never played Minecraft. And I never will. I will only play Minecraft when we hit a million subscribers. I don't even like watching people play Minecraft. Also, my sister is not a Minecrafter either, and I think that also contributed to it. Because when I was in, like, middle school and high school, it was, like, on the cusp of popping off. Like, if I were to be, like, four years younger, then yeah, I'd be a little Minecrafter. Would you play Terraria? I was considering playing Terraria, but for my free time. Like, off stream. That's one of my games to try. List. <laughs> Late on stream? I'll consider it. Okay, everybody. Last name of the day. If you want me to write your name today, all you need to do is follow my channel and you'll see me write your name right now. Last name. Guys, speedrun almost over. No mistakes yet today. Imagine I throw. followers for the month in very early June. Let's go ahead and flip through. Everybody, if you see your name, screenshot it. Yeah, I'll give you time to screenshot. To clip it. Man, we had a lot. We had over 30. About 30. Oh, not this page. Dude, this is the best song from We Fit. So big thank you to everybody who does follow the chatter alert. Shoutouts. Helping support the channel. Posting pictures of these on my Twitter later today. So exclamation Twitter and chat. I was gonna say if you want to see your name. If you followed in a previous month, you'll find yourself in that thread. Okay, so now moving on to the main meat of today's show. If you gifted five subs during the month of uh, May, you get your picture drawn today. We had two people eligible. We had Cole Bobo and Kim. And then from previous months, just backlog, we had Mac and Titans. Mac and Titans, these are both your last cards. We have backlog. So if you want your cards this month, you'll need to donate this month. Uh, I'm going to draw whoever's in chat first. We haven't seen Kim yet, so we'll do Kim last. And let's do... Let's do Cole Bobo first. I usually do Cole Bobo last. <laughs> <laughs> but we'll do first. Oh, I need my fine liners. I also gotta change my title. Everybody, um, put your favorite emote in chat. Put your favorite emote in chat. I gotta grab my pens. <laughs> I 
I stood up, frantically searching my room for my pen carousel, and it's right next to my stream desk. Silly me. Okay, I'm gonna update my title now. Did Mac and Kim send horizontal? Uh, I don't remember. But it's just like for some framing, some cards look better horizontal because like this with a vertical crop would cut off some of Mac's hair. Okay, I'm gonna get a sip of water. Okay, so for Kobobo's card, they sent me a picture of them wearing sunglasses and then a printed tee. But I think what I'll do instead is regular portrait, black shirt, and it had like a neon palm tree pattern. So I'm going to do neon colors today. Like neon yellow, maybe like a bright orangey, more saturated yellow. Hashtag not sponsored, but I will be using Sakura Micron Fine Liners. bad habit of not putting things in the same place if it's in my bedroom and I have these pens in a different spot than I usually keep them and then I'm also using Sakura Pigma brush pens oh dude an underwater pick would go crazy both of my phones yes chatters you heard me correct both of my cell phones are waterproof but you have to have like the little cap that goes in the charging port so, I, I just don't want to risk it. Okay, let's see. Let's do... Let's do a Micron Zero Two. glitches when I get a little bit of water in it. I know, mine too. That's why whenever I go out when it's raining, I always make sure I have my waterproof coat and it also has zippers on it. That way no water gets on my phone. And it's funny because it says it's waterproof, but the moment the tiniest dab of water gets on it, she glitches. I feel like it's false advertising, right? Whenever I do line art, I usually will turn the paper or the surface rather than the actual pen. It's because when you do line art, your your wrist is a ball joint, so there's a limit to how much it can turn. So if you're contorting your wrist for too long, it's gonna fuck up your wrist. You're not gonna be able to draw as long. Same thing with scissors. It's better to turn the paper like against the shape. I don't know, a little... Do we have any artists in chat? Does anybody give a shit? <laughs> I'm a 
gaming channel. Guys, if you like art, go follow Peace and underscore art on Twitch. I'll stream on it soon. Soon. Ooh, that line is perfect. One thing that irks me so much... Now I'm gonna throw a little bit of shade, okay? Flippers get rid of Something that irks me so much. Because my personal aesthetic, I'm very clean. I take a lot of pride in my line work if it's, a, if it's like a final project. Like, my line art is usually really clean, pretty consistent. I don't like when there's too much texture in a line art. Unless it's intentional. Like, see how all my lines... They all connect perfectly. I see so many speed drawings. This is an example of pencil. Like... I drew it in here with pencil, but see how that part sticks up a little bit? Like, that shit irks me so much whenever I'm watching, like, a speed draw, or when people just do line art. Whenever, like, the line art is, like, not super clean. And it's not intentional, it's kind of like, oh, they fucked up. It's like, oh, it makes- it irks- it grinds my gears. It makes me swipe away. <laughs> I know what's mean, but bro, get better at line art, come on. Okay, anyway, back to work. No more talking shit. I think also when you're doing line art, you do have to be very confident with sh with your strokes. Because what you'll see a lot of like new artists do is they'll do this. I'm drawing on the back. Like, instead of doing one stroke, they'll do a half stroke and then try to connect it. And then you usually get like an error here. You have to move your whole elbow when you do long strokes. I learned that in high school. Because my art teacher in high school, he was really good at like drawing perfect circles on the chalkboard. That was his thing. Oh, flex. Yeah, he was pretty cool. He also, he was like 6'4", and he was this tall, lanky guy. So his arm, like, width, was insane. Hot? Stop. 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 <laughs> Stop. Nah, I feel like everybody has a crush on some of their teachers at some point. But, okay guys, never act on it, okay? Just don't. It's statutory assault. <laughs> Can you do a smash or pass stream? Who would I smash or pass? What would- what would it be? Okay, that line is kind of fucked. Celebrities? No, I don't like to itemize people, okay? Unless it's jits and ankles. Oh, uh, see, you know how I was talking about earlier? When the line art doesn't connect properly? Yeah, I fucked up on the neck. I fucked up. Cancel me. I'm a hypocrite. No, if, if I did a celebrities smash or pass, I would literally just smash Jensen Eichels every time. It, it would be pointless. You guys already know the result. Did you make my neck thinner? Uh, look at W. <laughs> I don't remember. Did I? I feel like I made it thicker. Because usually when you pose, you, you stretch out your neck. Do you want me to draw the stubble? Cool, blah, blah. I was going to ask if you wanted me to.
นะโอเคHave palm trees. Anyway, I need to look like I have a baby face. Okay, got it, boys. In school, like the random facts books, in it being like more people die from coconuts falling on their head than shark deaths, and I, that never made sense to me. I think it's just an example of how the media chooses to focus on certain instances and events and casualties that happen. That's all. Let's end the prediction. Did I mess up the calligraphy? No, I did not. That is like a four month streak that I haven't thrown. If you die by a coconut, that's so sad. Yeah. Like, one of my biggest fears is um to get deep <laughs> for a second. It's like I feel so sad whenever I hear a story of like somebody dying young. Cause then I then I always think it was like that could be me. Like, all the random-ass deaths that occur sometimes. Like, either just wrong place, wrong time, or just bad RNG. And it makes me think, I was like... I, that's why, like, I try to be as nice as I can to people. Both online and in real life. Unless you really wronged me, then fuck you. Because, <laughs> like, all I can think about is, like, I don't want... The last thing I say to somebody is something, it'd be something mean, you know? Bestie, you're not young anymore? Mod, seriously, ban Lemon. You open, you come into stream saying that shit? No, no, no. Better clock in, Lemon. But hi, hon. Hope you're doing well today. Can we get some yos? The funniest chatter has just arrived. Um. Where was I going with that? Because, like, there's been a few times where, like, not that I've gotten close to death. But I feel like most everybody has gotten, like, near, close to getting to, like, a car accident, right? And any time that's happened, because, like, I've had a few close calls. Like, being in, like, an Uber car or just, like... I swear, any fucking time I'm in a car, something happens. Or you see, you drive by and see, like, an accident has occurred. And I, I just cannot help but to think, it's like, damn, I... I need to make sure I'm nice to people. Now we can erase. Oh wait, I gotta do eyebrows. <laughs> I always forget. Let's give you a bit more texture. Yeah, 
Yeah, Chatters, your guys' favorite song is in the We Fit playlist. So I don't get why you guys were so opposed to it earlier. I'm a hater? Yeah, you are. You're such a contrarian sometimes. But I am as well, so you know what? It's valid. Oh, instead of doing the shirt black, I'll probably just do pink. I figured out what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do the background fully black. Now look, everybody get ready. Look how straight my freehand lines are gonna be. Look how anti-pride my line work is gonna be. Damn! Look at that shit. I don't even need a fucking ruler. Are you guys impressed? Type one. because I can't draw a line through. these lines now is since there's gonna be lines that poke through here I want to draw those first so that way they're all lined up correctly See, if I would have drawn these lines in first, then they would have been crooked. Everybody, we are another 30 minutes in the stream. So if you're new here, pull the chat. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. Can we hit our daily goal, everybody? Okay, now I can start coloring.
Oh, this orange is not neon at all. Uh-oh. Dude, look at this one! It's so busted. pink to make orange. Overheat. Don't worry, it's coming, it's coming. All I gotta do is close all your windows, you know? Why did I do yellow? I should have done a green shirt. I grabbed the wrong color. I'm not colorblind, don't worry. These look a bit duller on camera, but these- oh, that looks a bit more real life. Hi, Crystal! Can I get some yo's? Hello! I talked about it early, Crystal, but your- your tweet the other day made me really happy. really sweet crystal made me feel good but I'm glad whatever I do makes you feel better you know I think I have neon sharpies. I think these look a lot better than highlighters. Oh yeah, that's so much better. I should have used the sharpies. Oopsie. Oh, these stank. Oh my god. They smell like licorice. Licorice has a smell? Yeah? Since when did it not have a smell? I mean... I don't know how to describe it, I guess. It's kind of like, how do you describe a, a color? Because I feel like licorice has a very unique scent. It's like chewing on a wire? No, I like the Twizzlers, those are fine.
Okay, it's fine if I color outside the lines because I'm filling in the background with black. Don't worry. I don't get how people like licorice. It's yucky. I think the reason why licorice was popping off is because it's chewy, so it keeps you entertained. Kind of like gum. It's not a candy that you can, like, guzzle down. And back in the older days when they didn't have TV or phones, that's what they did to keep themselves busy. One of my teachers had one of those big containers of Twizzlers, like, you know, those big tubs? And whenever you were good, you would get a Twizzler out of the tub. And before anybody asks, that is not why I'm obese. <laughs> I got fat after elementary. <laughs> Time to fill in. Actually, I'll do the first. Thank you for the light crystal. Are you gonna give the sun sunglasses too? Um, probably not. I feel like his face would be here, so it would be out of bounds. Final part is filling in the black. It's almost done.
Okay, I'm gonna retouch some of the hairline art and fill in any black space that I missed because when you're working with a felt tip, you can't get in certain corners. Those eyebrows go crazy. Yeah, I, I added a bit more texture. Like, they're a bit more rigid than, like, what Kobobo has. IRL. My sister and I watched Don't Look Up for the first time last night, and I put up watching it for the longest time because I figured it's going to be lived up, it's going to be way too on the nose, and I was right. It was, honestly, I believe it is an accurate representation of what will actually happen if there is a mass casualty event such as an asteroid, but it was so on the nose, it was <laughs> crazy. Anyway, it was fine. 8 out of 10. Yeah, I think this is good. Pretty solid. The black, I think, is too much. It looks... I think I would have done this part orange, and then this part yellow, and then this part not yellow. But still cool. It, the colors are a lot- it's actually- excuse me, it's actually neon if you see it in person. Cool Bubble, you do need to send me your uh, mailing address so I can send you your cards. I'll oh, see, those ca colors are a bit more accurate. There we go. Very nice, first card done. Fog you. Okay, next we will do Mac. Okay, so this one? I'm gonna focus on style, like how I actually do the liner. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try and give this one a bit more texture than I normally do. Bit less claim. Live laugh laugh. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you for the resub, Kim. Five months? You are insane. Here, let me replay the relay alert for you, because I don't have a copy. One second. Thank you, Kim. Wait. Did it show up on screen? It didn't show up on screen, did it? But hi, Kim. Welcome in. You're gonna get your card, John. Here's it. Here it is. Also, Kim, I tried to include your little tattoo, and I couldn't read what the the text or number was, so I'm just gonna write your mom. Do you think that's a good bit? <laughs> okay, let me double check that the alerts worked. Live, laugh, laugh. Okay, there it is. I, I had to double check it worked. It wasn't working earlier. Oh, it's because I, I updated the layers, but I didn't update this scene. There we go. It's 401. No, I think I think that your mom bit is funnier. <laughs> Fuck your tattoos. <laughs> okay, we'll do uh, Kim after Max card. But Kim, you're late. Clock in. But once again, thank you for the five months. You've been here for almost half a year. That's crazy. And your grandma's and your great grandma. My grandma, she's like 96. She's old. <laughs> but she's very active. Oh, 
Oh my god, everybody! Thank you, Koboba. I'll look at that after stream. <laughs> yeah, everybody go crazy! Go crazy! Dude, no way my Sharpie's dying. You should make a clock out function? No. I thought about that, and I don't want to do a clock out because I feel sad whenever chatter say, hey, I'm leaving. I'd rather people just like, not lurk, but just be like, casually pop in and out. Like, you don't have to announce you're departing. Unless you like, want me to like, say bye. And that's fine, I'll say bye to you, but like, don't feel like you got it. I, I just think the clocking bit is funnier. I think that's a funnier bit than like clocking out. Dude, everybody's freaking out in the chat. What's going on? Is it something I said? It's over. Sad. I think I'm gonna use a brush pen for the hair. I'm trying to find a medium tip. Because I've bought so many sets of these brush pens, because you can't buy singles. So I have so many bolts. I have a fine. I'm gonna use a medium. go through mediums the quickest. No, with fine points. Peace, it's freezing. Turn up the tent. No, it's summer! I don't want you guys to actually overheat, you know? I thought it was just RP. Me and your mom sleep in the bed? You know what I have to say to that, Mac? <laughs> Not a lot of my chant. I think the the newest ongoing bit is just deleting max messages. <laughs> That's the new bit. Okay, I'm gonna do really crazy texture for the hair. Everybody get ready. Now the cool thing about the medium with brush pen is you can get thin and super thick strokes. See, look at that. All with one single stroke. Okay, I need to swap this one's dead. Just like my channel. Well, this one has a lot of juice.
guys, don't don't drama farm, okay? I just don't want certain words in my chat. Can you block emojis? Yeah. Um, since I have Automod enabled, there was a time where the peach emoji automatically got blocked. Because, you know, it looks like an ant. Okay, let's fill in. But not eggplant? No, I think eggplant was also blocked. I'm gonna use a fine liner for the finger. Don't wanna mess it up. Is the subathon coming up? Yeah, in August. I'll do a 12 hour cap. Last year we hit seven hours. Can we smash this year's subathon, everybody? Hopefully by August I'll have a bit of spending money so I can contribute as well. Just as long as the birthday stream scam. I mean, yo, Popo, you were there for the whole 12 hours. You saw how beat I was by the end. Happy birthday, thank you. Yeah, I will admit the birthday stream was fun. I agree. 
It went by really quick. I don't know why. I think it's because, like, I, I had things prepped for 12 hours. And I didn't even do everything I was planning on doing. So I feel like that's why I went a bit quicker. Okay, I gotta mute. I gotta mute. My sister wanted to talk to me real quick. I can't hear anything. That's the point. It's muted. That's, that's the point. I <laughs> do me. <laughs> OBS is whenever you mute an audio source, it grays out the audio bars. Because usually it's green, but if it's muted, it's gray. So it's a visual indicator that you muted as well. Very cool, OBS. That's a dub. Okay, I don't know how I want to color this. I just like the line art. Like, the hair looks really cool. Are the roomies ever gonna chat again? I don't know. They're telling me they didn't log into the account ever since. But then they got a gifted sub and then they opened the Twitch. So they only use it if they're on stream, probably. Yeah, they did get gifted because they came home one day. They're like, oh, I got a gifted. I was like, cool. Does somebody want to give stream elements a sub? <laughs> Come on. <laughs> Wait, you know, talking about subs, everybody. We are an hour into stream, so it's time for me to run some ads. You can avoid that ad by subscribing for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee. Wait, skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link Amazon Prime Day Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe, see if you have a Prime sub available. It is, um, Prime Month, so, um, show your pride by priming. <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> uh, guess what? I get a snack. We'll see some of you guys in a few. Also, if you gift five subs this month, you yourself can get a cool sketch card. Wowie wow. Get boomed. Where is Peason's biggest fan? They're busy. They got a new job. So they can't watch stream as much. Sad. Big sad. But they still prime. Plus one, everybody. I think I'm gonna color in the coat black. Maybe this was a mistake. Oh no. I'll fill in details with white. Smiling like the Grinch. Haha. <laughs> Tee. Uh <-huh. laughs> what happens when you have 20 portrait cards to make? That would be insane. 
Because usually on average I do four a month, right? That'd be a hundred subs. Oh, late. I mean, in order for me to get that type of numbers, I'd have to be a hundred V Randy minimum. But damn. I don't know what I'd do. You know what I would do? I would just increase the price. <laughs> I would just be like, actually, it's 10 subs now. <laughs> do you guys like baked potatoes? Yes, yeah, mashed are always better. Hands down. I'm gonna make Max hair look like water. I've decided. I'm gonna use tone bows. Yeah, everybody, get a portrait card when they're just five subs. Now is the time. <laughs> Econ 101. <laughs> I mean, guys, I am a business owner now. Dude, Easter to music goes crazy. Still my favorite game of all time. Nothing will top it. I wish I had thick eyebrows. I would cut a line in. I've always wanted to get a slit in my eyebrow, but I'm too scared that I won't commit. You know, I'm scared of commitment. Unless it's your mom's, and then that's fine. You know, we've been dating for a while, I can commit. Pause. Doesn't this look like the sad character from Soul? No, that's not the right Disney movie. What's it called where the kid has like emotions in her head and then her parents think she's psycho? What's it called? Inside Out. Thank you, Lemon. Favorite chatter. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah, this looks like the sad one. Wait, did I say joy? I meant to say the sad one. Did I say joy? Dude, I'm actually brain dead. Wait, Kobobo sent you? Okay, then you're brain dead, Kobobo. <laughs> Thank God it wasn't me. Guys, I'm disabled. My brain is too big for my head, so it makes me kind of dumb sometimes. Okay, this is coming out a lot prettier than I envisioned this. This is honestly a dub. Okay, chatters, I have a question for you guys. Um, only the gays answer. What do you think of non-queer people saying slay? different. It makes me think they're queer. That's what I think too. But then I also kind of feel like it's not their word to use. I don't know. Slay is just fun to say. I have straights who mock 
queer slang. That's what I, that's my takeaway too. I think ultimately I'm indifferent. It's like different if they're using it. Cause like there's words you can use with your friends and that's fine, but it's kind of like, there's like an element to like perform, perf performative and then also like disingenuous and that's what I don't like. This is an anti-Kim jet. No, Kim is queer. Kim is queer. <laughs> I'd def rather them say slay than have the LGBTQ day. <laughs> Stop. Don't bring this up again. Don't. Okay, I think also, like, slay is one of the feeler words. Like, it's kind of what you say when you can't tell if they're queer or not. So basically, when, when straight people use it, it confuses me. I'm like, are you one of us? Or not? Okay, this hair is epic. I don't know what to do now. Wait, Mac, this makes you look like one of the blue-haired libs. <laughs> oh no! Should have the names of the songs in the top left? Um, I can sit- I tr I'm trying to figure out a way to do that. Um, but I use YouTube, I don't use Spotify. So... Like, it's just a YouTube video, and the only, like, song titles, they're in the descriptions. So, it's kind of like, if I have the songs, like, on YouTube Music, then I could just screen cap the, like, the player. Which is what I used to do. Like, you guys saw it in some of my older sub-only Animal Crossing. Like, if we did a late time, I would screen cap the YouTube Music playlist. But, for the, if it's just a comp on YouTube, then there's no way for me to, like, title the song. And I don't have Spotify because I am um, anti-capitalist. <laughs> I, don't, I don't know where that was going. I don't use Spotify because I have YouTube Premium, so I have YouTube Music. So it's like, why would I pay for Spotify if I have YouTube? I'm getting Mac blue eyes. This is the this is the shiny version of Mac. Can you draw people as Pokemon? No, I'm not gonna do any of that sh furry shit. No. But if you mean like drawing people as Pokemon trainers, I love that and that's cute, but I will not do it because everybody's done that. Like literally everybody has done that. I don't know what to do for the background. I think I'll just do like blue squigglies. Just to fill in. <laughs> Would you draw someone in a maid outfit? 
No, that's actual K I N K shit. No. I'm not a commissionist, okay? <laughs> Dude, I swear to god, every single commission artist draws the coolest things. Also, they're doing landscaping outside, so if you hear it, oh well. R.I.P. Headphone users. Yeah, see that looks a lot better than just white. a little crazy. I'm gonna do the same thing, but in a dark color. But I'm not gonna cover the whole thing. I'm only gonna do some blotches. do an actual mukbang? I think I would do it whenever I lose weight. I, I would feel too self-conscious, like just to be fully transparent, I would be- I would be too self-conscious. Cause like, imagine you click on the stream and you see like, plus size person with a whole table of food that's just asking for shit. And it's not that I'm like, not confident. I like how I look, but it's just like I I've gotten to a point where like I can handle a little bit of negativity, but it's just like some things will grind my gears and it will stick with me. And I acknowledge that. 
That's why, like, if I get any, like, shader in a comment, I just immediately delete it. Because I know if I leave it, or if I respond to it, it's gonna, it's gonna stick in my head. That's why it must be sub only. Yeah. I agree. I think for that type of idea, it probably would have to be, like, a bonus stream. Just to, like, make sure, like, we have no shitters at all. What if I did... Because if I get monetized on my YouTube channel, then we can do YouTube memberships. That could be a YouTube member stream. I mean, that won't be for the longest time, because I am far from monetized. Because, like, for the Twitch exclusivity contract updates, you are not allowed to co-stream if you're streaming the same content to Facebook or YouTube. But you can co-stream to vertical-based platforms like TikTok or IG. But you can still do like separate streams on Twitch and separate streams on YouTube. They just have to be for different things. So I've been like brainstorming what type of sub-only streams I can do for Twitch and then sub-only for YouTube memberships whenever I do unlock it. No, you can post, like, full VODs, you can post full clip Twitch clips to your YouTube. You, like, if I'm playing Mario Kart, I cannot simultaneously stream in real time to YouTube Mario Kart as well. That's what they're trying to prevent. Like, you know how Ninja was, like, streaming on, like, a million platforms at the same time? Can't do that shit anymore if you're gonna stream on Twitch. And that is for all streamers. How do you get memberships on YouTube? You have to be part of the YouTube Partner Program, so you need a thousand subs and then X amount of watch hours. Which, I have a thousand subs, but I need to get my watch hours up. It's a good reel? Shut up, Kobobo! Shut up! Twitch Dev, ignore them! Ignore Kobobo! The, the issue was with the co-streaming thing, they lifted that restriction a little less than a year ago, I think. And that was great! But now... They're putting it back. Yeah, put some L's in the jet. L take, L take. <laughs> Isn't that good? Okay, you don't get it because you're a viewer. If you're a creator, um, when you multi-stream, you are having a larger reach. Like if you have a hundred viewers on Twitch and fifty on YouTube, that is a hundred fifty concurrent which looks better to advertisers, that increases your brand image, your platform, because you have more viewers. And also you're more likely to grow on all the platforms that you're streaming on at the same time. That's like how we talked about before, people will stream on TikTok, them streaming on Twitch, just their desk POV, so they can bring people to their main platform, Twitch. But then are you only interacting with one chat? Typically, yeah. Like Ninja, I think he would interact with all chats at the same time, but then he would only read like one chat every minute. So, that was the argument Twitch was using. Like, you need to interact with your live viewers. See, why is Kobobo going all corporate right now? Are you, like, a Twitch op? What is this? Okay, I think this one's done. <laughs> yeah, I think, I think this one's done. I like it. Simple, cute. The hair looks banging. There you go. Thank you, Mac, for gifting subs um, a few months ago. Now you're all cut up. Very cute. Okay, let's see. Since Kim isn't in chat for now, I kind of want to... I want to say Kim's for last. Best for last. <laughs> okay, next is Titans. Titans gave me a picture of their dog. What do they say rent is due? What do you mean? I haven't heard that bit. At first, I didn't realize it was a dog. Guys, I'm ending. <laughs> I don't draw animals. 
<laughs> I don't draw animals. Thought it was a mask? Yeah, it's his furry suit, obviously. That's fine. The dog looks like ass. Because this was the sketch card I had to redraw, and the first dog sketch I had was great. What to do for you to draw furries? Dude, you know furry is a block curve. You know it is. I'm deleting that. Nice try, Potato. <laughs> I am not drawing furry shit. I am not doing it. There is no amount of money besides... A million subs right now. And only right now. This is the only time I would do it. I don't know what you're talking about. <laughs> yeah, the message is gone. Pee pee poof. Yeah, this one is kind of rough. Has Mac ever had VIP? No. Mac has never won a tournament. Ne Mac has never been best clipper. One day Mac will earn it, though. Whenever Mac gets clouded. Because the only people who get VIP in my chat are people of clout or my friends. Yeah, or yeah, if you use your channel points. Scam? It's not a scam. Okay, instead of doing lines, I'm gonna do crosshatch. Which is a technique I don't often use, but I feel like makes sense since it's a dog. Can we get holiday deals for VIP? No! The only deals you guys are getting is if you use code TWITCH10 on peaceandart.myshopify.com today! Everybody, get $10 off some original artwork. Those are the only deals I will give you guys. <laughs> Peace is the Grinch? No. -uh. My nose is far too large to be a Grinch. dog isn't bad.
Is the new collection being made? Yeah. My... So I have to wait till my Twitch payout goes through so I can buy paint. That's the problem. Because I have, um, two paintings done. So I have to make the replicas and then I have to wait for more paints to come in. Because I don't have the colors that I need yet. So I have to wait till my Twitch payout goes through so hopefully by Wednesday it processes and then I can order the paints and it takes about a week to come in the mail. So... It's probably, wait, let me look at a calendar. The goal is the last Friday of June. Oh, so exactly the 30th. <laughs> Oopsie. Cause my, my goal was the 23rd, but I'm not, I don't think I'm gonna get my paints in time. So it's probably gonna be the 30th. And I know I haven't been posting, and it, it's just so hard. Not to complain, but like, I have to do the, the Twitch clips. That's already a lot. And then homework, so it's kind of like... That's why I'm not posting as much on the art website. But you know what, that's fine for now. Like, the platform isn't big enough to justify investing like... Hundreds of hours into yet. And when I say platform, I mean my following. Especially when I have very limited time. You look so fuzzy. Dude. <laughs> If I like this, I'll keep going. I might, I might scrap this one and try again next time. I'm, I'm like, I don't like this one at all. Wait, the mouth is kind of good. Wait. Wait. She just, just likes anything furry. Nah, it's just like... The dog looks fine, but Titans looks like shit. Oh shit, I didn't do the hair. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. He looks ill. No, his his eyes are too far apart. I think I think the, the thing that's really bothering me with it is that the dog, the line art, is full of texture, right? But then these lines are way too smooth, so it's it's off-putting to me. I will try thicken up the lines. I think that might help me get over my screen.
Okay, that, that is kind of helping a little bit. I just have to darken some of these parts. If it would take an exact amount of money, how much would it be if we did Joe Furries? Like I said, a million subs. So that would mean my cut would be a little less than 500k. <laughs> I think Potato's trying to tell us something. I mean, we already know that they chew on everything they see. <laughs> never mind, never mind. <laughs> never mind. Yeah, I would, I'll just say it's fitting. It makes sense. You know what else makes sense? Follow the channel, because everybody, we are another 30 minutes into the stream. So if you're new here, follow. You get cool emotes and the ability to type in chat. Can we get some more followers today? Help hit our goal. Smile. No, I don't think furries are like trying to be animals. My understanding is that they feel more comfortable. It's like literally masking. Where they feel like they don't have to be like... they don't have to like adhere to like the social norms of like making eye contact or behaving in a way that's like <sighs> normal's not the right word it's kind of like you know when you're interacting with people like strangers like you have to uh, so right. I don't know how to explain it For some people, it is a K and K thing, and then for others, it's like just comfort. I'm gonna fill in the background black. I think that'll help me. Okay, get ready for the straightest line. Anti-pride line. Okay, that was horrible. Okay, not bad, I saved it. straight your gauge well I didn't realize I was queer until like middle school so you know I had like 15 years of practice I want this to look like one of the photo booth cars that has like the little icons on it Dude, this is the final boss fight song. It's so good. She's been lying to us? Yeah. Okay, you know what I think is the most, like, fucked up argument? Like, anti-queer uh, anti argument? Where they're like, oh, they're faking it for attention. And it's like, bitch, why would you lie about being a marginalized person? Like, why why would you choose to, like, potentially be hate-crimed? I, I hate that argument so much. It's, it's so, like, insensitive.
And I feel like if people could choose, like, don't you think they would not want to be, like, marginalized? I don't get it. I think the best way to explain it is... <laughs> Just to know what it's like in someone else's shoes. <laughs> Uh, th now is not the time to be a debate lover. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. I can't. <laughs> oh. I think the best argument or way to explain it to somebody who doesn't get it is oh, you think being queer is a choice? Go fuck a guy right now. If it's a choice, right? You could easily just do it, right? And that argument was like okay, it was not his exact words. But it's an argument that I heard from Philip DeFranco. And it just makes sense. Like, if, if you truly think being queer is a choice, then go fuck somebody else. Prove it. So anytime... It's like, I've, I've had a few people who, like, question it. And I, whenever I use that argument, they're like, oh. That makes sense. <laughs> it's like, oh, shut up now. Okay, this looks so much better now. I think this saved it. I'll ask that to all my straight friends who tell me that. See, isn't it such a- it's a- it's a very, like, blunt retort, but then it- for most people, it makes a- it makes it click. You know what this kind of looks like now? This looks like a manga panel. I'm sad that the rubber part from my white brush... Wait. I'm sad that the rubber part from where I hold my brush is falling apart. Man! may not be for me biting it. See, you beat me to the punchline. Potato, I think you should invest in some chewing gum. Or you should apply to be on a TLC show. Both work. end up swallowing the gum? Ooh, that is bad, then. Hmm, you say too? Hmm. I 
I mean, maybe talk to your doctor. Titan's dog is kind of like a golden roddy. So I think this color. And then I'll mix in some tan too. Right now I'm mixing in a very light tan. Final color to fill in the white space. I'm gonna use a very, very, it's like a pale, tanny yellow. Subs go dark tomorrow. Are they doing like server changes? If so, that's great. Reddit is bad. Oh, to protest? Huh? Oh, I gotta color the tongue. Yeah, not gonna lie, I've fallen into the pit hole of the Reddit story dubs on TikTok and YouTube. I enjoy Reddit, it's not as bad as people make it out to be. I always get scared whenever I see a Reddit defender. I'm like, uh oh, what have you said in the DMs? Okay, I think this one's done. <laughs> yeah, I was I was kinda scared. 
I know this one's simpler. Titan's face, kind of icky, okay? Kind of icky. But the, the way in a lot of pictures that Titan's, like, angles his face and make you can't see his neckline and it's very hard to get the angle right without properly shading but i think it's cute it's cute okay everybody final card of the day kim this one i want to do black white and red or pink i think pink would go crazy let's get to work I'm gonna start off with a fine liner and then do brush pens. Kim served. Okay, not gonna lie. I like drawing women and or like people who are more female presenting. I don't know. I'm biased. I'm sexist. I'll say it. <laughs> I can get a wig. <laughs> no, you're fine. You're fine. <laughs> I was gonna ask why, but what if, like, Kobo was, like, a cancer patient, and now we're making fun of them? <laughs> Kobo, but you should have done the bit! I gave you the bit. If I wouldn't have said anything, that would have been a crazy bit. But then it'd also be an ableist bit, and I don't know if that's, like, good. Let's make me interesting. <laughs> yeah. See, I'm gonna get cancelled. I've never worn a wig. The only time I wore a wig was for my kindergarten play. We had to do a circus. And I was a clown. And I had to wear a wig and it was horrible. And I never wore a wig again. I also never wore makeup again because I had to wear a clown makeup. And it was horrid. Fine is fine. We'll, we'll see it's stylized. super long. I think it goes to like her like just past her shoulders but it's really thick. 
It'd be dragging on the floor? Really? I mean, in the pictures I've seen, it's only really gone. Oh, in the pictures I've seen, it, it usually crops at, like, her torso. I don't know. Lamau does it? St stop baiting me, you're so mean. You're so mean. When people hair that goes down to their legs, it's crazy. That's what my sister was trying to do for a while, but then she stopped. I feel like it would be way too heavy. It'd also be like a lot to manage. Headache from your hair? That's what I'm saying. Someone could also drag you by your hair, but then you could also do a really good ring cosplay. And I think that makes it worth it. I had a tattoo and I couldn't read it, so I just put your mom. <laughs> okay, Kim's glasses are gold, so I'm gonna do orange sharpie and then I'm gonna go over with gold ink just so I can erase. I think I'm gonna fill in the background with red. I feel like that'd go crazy. You know what else goes crazy? The ads! Because everybody, we are three hours into stream, so time for me to run some ads. I'm actually speedrunning while I'm fine. 
three cards in two hours, not bad. So, if you want to avoid that ad, all you need to do is subscribe for $4.99, just $5. Skip your coffee and get ad free viewing all month long. Or you can link Amazon Prime to your Twitch and hashtag sub for free with Prime. Click subscribe to see if you have a Prime sub available. You know, it is Pride Month, so show your pride by subbing with Prime. <laughs> Dude, they should hire me for the marketing team. Anyway, um, after the ad, we're gonna finish Kim's car. So we're almost done. We're speed running. Um, get some water, get a snack. We'll see some of you guys in a few. Also, if you gift five subs, I'll draw you next month. You can get your own por custom portrait card. Back to work. I'm gonna go in with. I'll do a fine liner. I think that's what I'll do. Also, with the fine liner, I can kind of clean up some of the lines. Okay, so I have the base interior lines filled in. You, you can see here I added like some wispy strokes here. So I'm gonna add that along all the outside edges of the hair. After I film the eyebrows.
Now when you're doing like the outside hair lines, you don't want to do them too close to like the base shape. You want there to be like big gaps. You're not gonna like Kim's hair was kind of messy in the picture. <laughs> Nobody tell her, though. Delete the VOD. <laughs> but see how much, like, texture that adds? Okay, I think we're gonna do red now. Oh, this is like a cherry red. Holy. Now when I fill in the background, I'm not gonna leave these spaces white. I'm gonna fill them in. This Kirby music goes crazy. Yeah, it's not often we I play this comp. Yeah, I can see. Feeling in the background color all the way to the base shape of the hair. If I would have left this part white, the shape would have been wrong. It looks a lot more brighter on camera, but in real life it's like a a deep cherry red. It's more of a bright red on camera. But that's because I have color filters on. I think I'm using portrait mode on my DSLR. Oh wait. Kim's here with brown. I think if I leave it white, it's too similar. I'll do a medium brown. This is the 947. Oh yeah, this is looking better. That looks a lot better, IMO. Similar thing. I'm only coloring in the base shape of the hair, not coloring in the parts that have gaps where the wisps are. 
gaps where the wisps are. This card goes crazy. I mean, it's because Kim sends good pictures. <laughs> it's also like, I, I think like the texture of like long hair, I really like how I render it. Because it, it's more focused on like the line arc than the shape. That's why like I like doing max hair. Because since it's curly like mine, you can do like different ways of like styling the line art of it. Sakura gel pens, jelly roll. Hashtag not sponsored. Guys, if I had a pen sponsorship, that'd go crazy. It would also make sense. Yeah, I'm gonna do the gold first, because that has the most more precise line work. Oh yeah, doing the orange underneath does a lot. I mailed out Kim's of the cards, but doing the orange underneath makes the color stand out so much more. And it gives it like a back glow effect, kind of. Because some of the orange peeps through. It's kind of more bronzy than gold, but it's cool. Okay, I'm gonna do white on the eyes as normal. And then I think I want to do like a little glimmer. Oh, this white pen is dead. It's not dispensing at all. You went hard on this card? Well, that's why, like, I like the ones that are close-up pictures. Because Kim sent me a close-up, so you can put a lot more detail in it. It's not- it's more focused on, like, the features rather than the form. Just like, this one, full body. This one, torso up. Torso up. So I think the- the people who have, like, more texture in their hair, I think the close-up pictures look a lot better. I didn't fill in the hair completely, there's still some white parts. Eight? <laughs> Eight out of ten, holy. I think this one's done. 
simple, but more focus on texture. You meant eight like eight? Oh, <laughs> okay. Saved. <laughs> okay, chaz. We have completed all of our missions. All of our tasks for today. By we, I mean me. I try harder today. I pushed through, honestly, because I'm really fucking tired. But you know what? I was like, I can't go another day without seeing chat. So let's review what we did today. I was here, yeah, everybody, we're done. But don't worry, stream is not over yet, because we're going to do um, calligraphy, so you can use your channel points or donate to the channel. I broke the rubber band. Guys, it's over. Um, oh, shit. <laughs> Wrong one. It's Jover. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. <laughs> Dude, that's a bummer. We have more of our bands, it's fine. Okay. I gotta, I gotta clean up my desk a little bit. Dude, my head hurts. Whenever I do these art streams, I have to put my ring light on full blast and it hurts my eyes. Oh, you know why I went faster today? It's because I didn't use any color pencils. Color, color pencils take longer. I mean, I like the look of markers anyway. You get a pretty solid fill. Okay, let's review. Okay, if I show feet, nobody clip. We're good. <laughs> okay, so let's review. We did our follower calligraphy journal. So if you followed during the month of May or very early June, you'll see your name. And if you followed in a previous month, you will see your name on my Twitter thread. I post all these pictures after stream. There we go. And then we also had... Ignorlo. Our sketch cards from the month of May. It Kobobo. Mac. Titans. And finally, Kim. Favorite card? I'm a big fan of simple. I think Kim's came up the best. I like the textures on Max. This one looks crazy on camera. The orange is so bright. <laughs> there we go. Okay, so I will be posting these on Twitter later as well. Now we're gonna do calligraphy. You guys know the drill. If you donate to the channel or use your channel points, I will write your name. Any redeemers? We did get a resub today, so I'll do Euler names first. I gotta update my title. Yeah, I remember potato. I would I would never forget. I have never forgotten. Never ever.
Thank you for deeming, Cool Bubble. Cam with a five month resub. So close to the six month badge. Cheddars, I have a question. Tomorrow, should I do sub only cult of the lamb or art channel calligraphy? Because I have a phone call in the morning, so I won't be able to do a full normal stream. What would you guys want to do tomorrow? Once again, thank you, Kim, for the five month resub. Thank you. <laughs> so I just realized the the mic registers I'm on the on the PNG tuber model whenever I. <laughs> it's almost like I'm clicking my tongue. the last name of the day if you want me to register name all you need to do is donate or use your channel points last call any more redeemers good guys i have a headache <laughs> i think it's like 
whenever I focus, I can I can dial in. But then when I stop focusing, I'm like, I just tank. My brain is too big. <laughs> Last goal, I all got five. Four. Three. Two. One. And we're done. We're done. Okay, let's review. Oh wait, full cam. Base review! Just kidding. Um, I would like to thank everybody for watching. Any chatters, lurkers, thank you all for hanging out today. A rare Sunday stream? Um, because I didn't stream Thursday or Friday. You guys know the drill. Watch the VOD if you want to catch up a little more. Um, I will be live tomorrow, probably. Crossing my fingers. Um, I'll either be live tomorrow with a subscriber-only stream on this channel, playing Cult of the Lamb, or Art Channel Calligraphy. So you guys know the drill! Exclamation art in chat. Go follow at Peacein underscore art on Twitch. It is tagged in the title, so you can follow straight from the title as well. Um, I'm trying to do weekly streams. Smile. Keyword trying. It's not a dead channel, don't worry. <laughs> um... I had fun today. I was planning on only doing two cards, but, you know, I pushed through and I got four done. I'm all caught up. So, um, from this point on, no more backlog of cards. I'm all caught up. So if you yourself want a custom portrait card, all you need to do is gift five subs to the channel by the end of June. Um, yeah, it was fun. Once again, thank you to anybody who watches any chatters, lurkers. Thank you all for hanging out. It's always a good time. I did miss you guys the past few days. I'll be honest, I did miss you guys. Okay, last thing before I go. Make sure everybody... I talked about it earlier. But I am uploading YouTube exclusive... YouTube exclusive videos on my clip channel. I am going back and editing at literally any funny clip from the past two years of me streaming. So if you yourself make clips during a stream and you don't see it in the best of compilations, don't worry, you might see it in a full YouTube video. Smile. Yeah, that's all I got for you guys today. I'll see you guys later. Okay. Also, if you don't follow the channel, fucking follow. <laughs> okay, bye-bye. Bye-bye. Okay, bye guys. <laughs>